Elsewhere now, following delays surrounding the ascension of the Ulubado stool, a member of the Ulubado in council has revealed that the king designate is not currently physically fit to rule and must be allowed to recover before ascension. The Otum Balogun High Chief Abimbola Ajibola revealed this while addressing newsmen in Ibado. We have details of that story now and return with business news. It's been close to one month since the death of the 42nd Ulubadon of Ibadan, Obalikon Balogun. And since then, controversies have continued to trail the emergence of a new traditional ruler. According to the traditional structure of ascension in Ibadan, the most senior member among the Ulubado in council is entitled to the throne, depending on the ruling line that follows, either the civil or the military line. Presently, the military line, Balogun, is entitled to the throne, but there are concerns regarding the health of the king designate, Oola Biolakulei. Following this development, a traditional council member of the Olubadon has stated that a crucial criterion for ascending the throne is physical fitness. There are certain conditions that have to be fulfilled. To be qualified as Olubadon, it's not me because uh, I'm the most senior, I'm Olubadon. If the ascending conditions are not fulfilled, you are disqualified automatically. You must be, you must not have been prison for more than three months. You must not have been convicted for more than three months. You must be in good condition, good medically fit and sound. I.e., you must not be totally blind. You must not be deaf. You must be able to move yourself. You have to recognize and talk to the people. He urges those demanding a swift declaration of the Olubadon designate to respect the law's requirements. Recover. He need to recover. You know, they brought him in since on that day. Only four of my people went to see him out of about ten. You know? And after seeing him, nobody has seen him again. Those who went didn't see him. It means he has not been well enough. How do you want him to go through the hall and eat noodles? To go to Mako, climb the do you think going to be enthroned in the room? It's going to be Mako, you know how they make platform there. You have to be among the crowd. Suppose anything happens to him. They will say, Why are you people doing like that? They will take us for food now. Give him time to recover. So laugh it collapse, it collapse. The traditional leader believes that the delay in the ascension of the Olubadon throne underscores the importance of adhering to traditional protocols and ensuring that the designated ruler meets the necessary criteria for ascending the throne. Oladio Yewole, TVC News, Ibadan.